popping beautiful people up in YouTube land. Yeah, before I start this video, I want to say that the giveaway is still in full effect. If you want to enter, just watch my last video and complete the steps and then you enter. Like I said from last time, it's pretty so forward and your chances of winning is really high. So, but today I got my hands on yet another Yeezy. And this month, Kanye's dropping, I think like 12? Yeah, I think like 12 Yeezys this month for September, which is crazy. And this one is the first one. Well, technically it's supposed to be the second one, but this is the first one, because the magnets got redropped to tomorrow. But I'm talking about the inertias. So without further ado, let's get into it. Yeah. Same old, same old, 700 bucks. Got the inertia, 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 inertia. Um, they released yesterday, Saturday. Of course, these was going for, for a regular price of $300. Um, this is the V2 of the actual inertias. Obviously, they dropped the V1s of these. Basically, like the OGs and the toe part, like the originals, they got that like bluish gray, like ice blue gray going on. Then on the mesh on the front of the toe and then on the sides, it's like a light gray on the leather parts. A little darker gray. In the midsole, you got them peach driplets going on, which is the best attribute of the shoe. The bottom of the sole give that light gum bottom. They went back. I mean, to the first two V2s with the 3M on the sides, because the Tefras doesn't have it and the Vantas doesn't have it. Vantas got like that one. 3M on the top. And the tongue also got that icy blue on the other parts of the side. And then the back, it's like that dark gray also as well. Inertia V2s. Now, I'm looking at these. Um, I, I haven't worn my other, I haven't worn my V1s yet. So now I'm about to compare both of them to see which one I actually want to keep. Here we got side by side uh, V1s and the V2s. Um, yeah, like I said, same colorway, spot on. Only difference I see off rip is the gum bottoms. The bottom of the V1s is way lighter than the bottom of the V2s. V2s is giving more like that. Giving more of like a, a vintage clear looking bottom. That's like, and this one's just like, it's like a light cream, like a very, very light cream. Another thing that I also see um, is the gray on the V1s, whereas the suede is at is way darker than the suede on the V2s. Um, also, the light gray and the dark gray con contrast is a little bit darker than this light gray to dark gray contrast on the midsole. So it is a few um, differences of the shoes. Oh, now that I'm peeping, peeping it, um, the peach on the V1s is way lighter than the peach on the V2s too. But me looking at both of them, I don't know. Which one do I like better? Hmm. See, which one, I don't know which one I like. Cause if I, if I like one better than the other, I'm definitely gonna get rid of the other one. Um, they both dead stuck. So I don't know, man. Um, Hmm, let me see. One eternity later. I think I like the Nurses V2 like by a pinch more. I don't know why, I just think I like how sleek this this version is compared to the OG, which is a little bit more on the bulkier side. Um, I think I might lean towards these on keeping these actually, which it wasn't like that from be before. Like I was actually trying to keep these. Um, 
I don't know. Let me know in the comments box below which one you guys prefer better. Um, I think not. Nah, now I'm thinking about I like these more because like these are the OGs. But I don't know, man. Oh, that shit is hard. I don't know. I got some. I got some real thinking to do. But yeah, man, this is V2 inertia, man. I would say if you was getting these to resell. That's a no-go. Um, these should be for personal use only. Um, like every other V2, they, they're not going for that much because they make a lot of pairs. The only ones I think that actually might be going for resale is the Magnus because it's an easy supply exclusive. So that might be doing numbers, but these right here, psh, only for the toe, bro. Only for the toe. I'm just happy that they brought back the 3M on the laces because that's what we... I was missing on the Tefras and the Vantas. The Vantas, man, I need I need to find laces like these, like, so I could switch the laces. I, I feel like they look 10 times better with, with these laces on them. Um, but yeah, man, it's a dope shoe, dope shoe. Like I said, with my comparison just a few minutes ago, if you have the Inertia V1s, you most likely do not want these. Um, like, vice versa, if you have these, you don't need the the V ones. Kanye make he, he he helping me save money. <laughs> Cause what I really want, what I'm really looking forward to, is the new silhouettes, man. Um, d do I like the V threes? Um, I gotta see them in person. They they giving me like NMD vibes. Uh, and I'm not really a fan yet per se of them. Um, but what I'm really looking forward to is them Quantums, and I think they drop it next year. I need those, I need those, I need those. I'm trying to get two pairs stunt on the court and stunt chilling outside, you feel me? Oh, the only like sneaker down Phoenix for that I already have of that silhouette is the 500 Soft Visions. When those drop, I need those. And Kanye, since you dropping those, you need to drop those lavender ones. These, man, I'm begging you, bro. I need both of those colorways and pastel colorways hit differently, you feel me? That was the video, man. Like, comment, subscribe if you like what you've seen. Um, comment down below, did you go out and cop this week? Um, which one is your favorite? Is it the V1 cities or the V2s? I'm gonna try to cop those those magnets. It's gonna be hectic to get those, but I'm gonna try to cop those to do a review on those. But until then, I'm out. Peace.